Well, I caught up with uh, Dame Kate Bingham, managing partner at SV Health Investors and the UK's former vaccine task force chief on the sidelines of the Global Investment Summit here in the UK, where she told me the only way to prevent the creation of new variants is to get everyone jabbed. Boosters will be important to retain um, protection for the elderly and the vulnerable. And there's un unequivocal data that a third boost is helpful for that protection. Um, so far, all the variants that are emerging so far are um, captured with all the current vaccines. So at the moment, we are seeing that the current vaccines are able to reduce uh, death and hospitalisation and serious disease, which is incredibly uh, happy uh, and we're lucky that that's still the case. Having said that, for as long as the virus is circulating unimpeded around the rest of the world, a solution for the UK will not be a durable solution. We have to get everybody vaccinated if we are to actually contain this um, virus. Well, Kate Bingham also stressed that countries like the UK need to get more creative with how they invest in COVID-19 treatments. The vaccine formats are not really fit for purpose. They have cold chains, they're difficult to scale, they require, in most cases, two injections being delivered by a healthcare professional. So the first thing we need to have is a fundamental reformatting of vaccines, whether it's pills, patches, sprays, implants, whatever they are, which can be delivered by non-healthcare professionals, which can be scaled without that cold chain so that you can actually get to the whole world. It's no good, again, vaccinating the, the Western world without actually addressing all those people who are at risk. So I think vaccine format is, is an area of near-term investment opportunity. Um, manufacturing, obviously, we don't have enough uh, or haven't had enough manufacturing supply. And there's lots of new technologies like blow fill seal. So instead of using glass for vials for, for containing the vaccine itself, are there higher um, throughput, lower cost um, approaches, more eco approaches to actually um, vial the, the vaccines? Um, therapeutics, I mean, again, we have been quite slow to get targeted therapeutics. So I think investment opportunities into drug platforms that will allow very quick um, tailoring of therapeutics against new viruses is an area I would look hard at, whether that's um, antibodies or more, more likely small molecules. Antibodies are always going to be limited in terms of how many people can be dosed. Um, and then more fundamentally, I still think immune therapies and modulating the immune response is fundamentally going to be the way medicine is moving.